So over here, you can see that I am in a website. And if I were to go around and click on this particular picture right here, then I get to this picture right here, as you can see. If I were to go around and click, then I get to this other piece, as you can see right here. So let's say what I want to do is I want to get back. And let's say I, I, I don't have this option right here. So in that case, what I can also do is I can go around onto the top and then I can click on back and then I get to the previous page as you can see from over here. So I can go around onto the previous page again and then I get to the previous uh, web page that I was surf surfing for. So you can do this as many times as you have uh, as it is possible. Um, so uh, I can also go around and click to go forward right here just like this and I get to the next piece right here as you can see so let me just go around and click right here and then i'm going to click right here so i can go around and click on back or forward to that particular uh, piece right here so let's say i want to go around and then see the update in a particular piece maybe you're watching a news site and you're not getting the latest information and you want to simply refresh out the content in that case you can go around and click on refresh right here and the content will be refreshed and if there's any update in the particular web page then you'll be able to see it right here so that is what you have as you can see so i can go around back right here and then uh, again back right here just like this and then what happens is that sometimes when you're actually loading a website you get this cross button right here which allows you to stop loading so if i were to go around and do this quickly enough then you don't get the uh, uh, images and everything else let's say for example you're uh, you're on a metered network and you don't want to actually go around and waste too much data and you load it out along a uh, wrong website in that case what you can do is you can simply go around and then stop out uh, the, uh, the loading content when you're access, um, accessing the website that you don't want to visit to save bandwidth data as well so that is what you can do over here as you can see as well and if I were to go around and click on the home button right here, then I get to the home page that is the default uh, um, uh, that is the default of Microsoft Edge. So that is how you can go around and work around with website navigation option inside of Microsoft Edge. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.